For cheap and bulletproof hosting, head over to Crident.com. Link in the description down below. Hey guys, welcome to a Crident Networks tutorial. Today we're going to be talking about installing Dark RP, ULX, and getting Super Admin. The first thing that you'll want to do is you'll want to go to control.crident.com. Once you're there, you'll need to log in. So once you've entered your username and password, this will be contained in an email that you'll get when you first bought the service. If you don't know it, then you can contact support on the normal website and we'll be able to help you out there. So once you're logged in, go to game services and here you should see your server. Um, so the first thing you want to probably do is go to the mod manager to grab some mods. So if you're watching this video, it's likely that you're looking for Dark RP and ULX mainly. So the first thing you'll probably want to grab there is Dark RP. Dark RP also requires the CSS content, so you'll also want to install that. Um, and then after that, we'll also throw ULX on the server too. So once these have all installed, what you'll want to do is you'll want to go back to your server and then you'll want to go to the command line manager. Now, if you go into the custom command lines tab here, you can click new and create a new command line. Now you'll just need to enter a name, this doesn't matter, I'll enter dark RP. Um, and you won't need to bother with any of this stuff, but the ones you'll be interested in mainly is game mode, start map, if you're going to be using an RP map, and probably the Archon password. So, I'll set password as an example, obviously never use that. You might be interested in changing the tick rate. By default, we have it on 22. This works really well for most servers. So I'm going to leave that just like that, and I'm going to click Save. Then what you want to do is you'll want to select the command line. It should be selected by default, but just double check that it's selected. Um, and once that's selected, go back, and you can just start the server. So once you click Start, the server will start up. And if we go to the command line manager, you can see here it's changed to dark RP. That was just ULX right there, and the server's up. So to join the server, if you go here, you can see the server IP. So if you launch Gary's mod, go to the console, which you can access by pressing the button beneath escape, uh, and type connect, and then paste your IP. Just press enter, and you should get joined to your server. Um, it will probably make you download a few default files for dark RP when you're joining and I'll continue this video and I'm loaded in. So as you can see I'm loaded in and ULX is clearly working as the MOTD here is open. So what you'll want to do is first you'll want to go back to here and what you'll want to do is you'll want to go to the web console. So it will ask you for an Archon password. Now we set this in the command line manager just a minute ago. If you didn't set one you can go back and set one. So what you want to do is just type your Archon password and once you've done that it'll ask you to enter any commands. So to add yourself to Super Admin it's quite simple. What you have to do is type ULX space add user space your username and it doesn't have to be the full username but be careful as if someone is using a very similar username it will give them the rank if it's not specific enough. Once you've done that type another space and then just put Super Admin at the end that's the highest rank by default. Hit enter, it will go through, and if you check in game, you should have got super admin, as you can see right here. And if you type exclamation mark menu, you'll get the super admin menu. As you can see, dark RP is also working, the F4 menu and the HUD in the bottom left hand corner. So now you're ready to go set your server up, install some add-ons, make it unique. Don't forget to check out Crident Networks, link will be in the description.